Hi, I am Roxana from VP Estate and in this video I will show how to create a real estate domain for a single owner or single listing using the VP Rentals team. On this domain I have installed the team, the included plugins and I have imported the main demo. Since I will set the domain for single owner, I will use the admin account to submit listings and manage bookings from front end. I will show how to set the team for single owner. First I will go to user dashboard. Here this is the user dashboard. I will go to my profile page and here the owner details will need to be added. The first name, last name, email address and the image will show on the listing page. Also, you can add a short description. All these elements will show in property page in owner section. The image, name and the short description. The messages from contact form and booking request emails will go to the email that you added in my profile page. Next in user dashboard you will see my subscription section that will be enabled by default from the demo. In this section owners will be able to purchase membership packages but since you will be the single owner you will need to disable this option from admin, team options, payments and submit, submission payment settings, set it to no for the submission to be free. Now in user dashboard that section will not show anymore. In my listing section the owner will be able to manage his listings, he will be able to edit, delete or disable listings. From add new listing the owner will be able to submit listings. The listing submission and booking request will need to be managed only from front end. The booking requests are managed from my booking section. I simulated two bookings. This is how they will show. This is the full user dashboard. Since you will be a single owner, you need to limit the access for other users to only be able to book. In order to achieve this, you need to go to Team Options, General, Login and Register and add here your username. I will add my username here and save changes. From now on, only my account will have access to submit listings. I will log in with a different account to show how the user dashboard will show for guests. You can see that only my profile, favorites, my reservation, my inbox and logout options will be available. If I log out from this account, on homepage you will see the submit property button. This will need to be disabled. You can do it from team options, general, header, show submit listing button in header, set it to no. Now only the login and register options are visible in page header. With all these settings the domain is now suitable for a single owner. If you will have a single listing available in the domain, the first step that you will need to do is to disable the search form. You can do this from admin, team options, search, show advanced search, set it to no. The form will not show anymore. The next steps are to set home page to fit the single listing. Setting the home page is more of a matter of business model or preferences, so I will just give some quick guidelines on how to change demo home page. For a home page header, we have selected team slider that will display the featured image of the property, but you can change it to any other available header. You can change page header from the back end of the page. You will need to go to Appearance Options. 
and from here select Image, Revolution Slider, Google Map, Video Header. If you wish to display the booking form in home page, we have a booking shortcode available. The team supports both Bakery plugin and Elementor one, so I will show how to add the shortcode in pages created with Bakery and Elementor. This page was created with Bakery. This is the shortcode. Here you need to add the listing ID. I have here a page that was created with Elementor plugin, so I will edit with Elementor. Go to VP Rentals widgets. This is the booking shortcode. I will edit at the end of the page just to show how it needs to be set. Here you will need to add the ID of the listing. Our demos were created for multiple listings, but using Elementor plugin or Bakery plugin, you can create the home page with the elements that you need. I hope that the details in this video will help you create the site that you need. Thank you for watching and please do not forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel to get instant notification on new videos.